Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing my stitch fix for May. I am so excited. I have been waiting for this. They said it was coming like a week and maybe two days ago. I've been looking, looking, waiting to see if the mailman dropped it off. It was there today. I am so excited. I'm going to do the video right away and get it over with because I want to see what I got for May. So what do I need? My scissors and my stitch fix. Yay, there it is. Yahoo! Remember, it comes as it is just like this cut it open remember choppy and piper i don't know if you can see him you might see the back end of choppy he's on his well he's not on anything he's chewing his kong with his milk bone in it piper's got the same thing and they've also got a little pumpkin in there okay why is this so hard okay you guys Keep my scissors really close as we all know it comes with the return bag with return on it already so you don't have to worry about that that's the one thing about stitch fix i love that and look at two different packages all right so i'm so excited so i'm not even gonna look but here's the first one and then, oh, I can't get it out. The second one. And then you also get this cute little nifty envelope. Take it out. The first thing is just like a little style guide that says, oh, hello. And then you get the receipt and tells you how much everything is. And we'll go over that when I'm all done. So I'm going to put those there, the envelope there, and let's dig into this. Ooh, it's really a hat. Oh, here goes. Okay. The first thing is, and I don't know if this is front or back. Okay. Huh. It's got buttons. Can you guys see that? It's got some buttons there. And it's navy with white polka dots. Is that coming across as that, or is it coming across as black? And then it's got kind of a ruffle halfway through the sleeve and then it's got a fitted sleeve or a gathered sleeve and then it's gathered at the bottom can you guys see that and then this little like a I don't know what you call that like a little scalloping around the whole top of it hmm I don't know I don't know it's different I'm not gonna like you know, be too judgy right away because I'm not even gonna, I'm not even sure how it's gonna look. Oh, the second one looks cute. Okay, it's got ruffles around the neck or a ruffle around the neck, and then it's split a cute little sleeve. It's kind of got that flare of a sleeve. Here's the back. I'll get the tag out of the way. That's the back, kind of long. I'm not big into print like this. I like a smaller print and it's green. Oh, and I didn't tell you where the first one was from. You guys, I'm being bad. The first one is called Sanctuary. And let's see here. Sanctuary is a off the shoulder ruffle detail blouse and it's a navy. Yes, it is off the shoulder. Second one that I showed you with the print, the green, is 41 Hawthorne. And let's see here. That's a Tiffany Tulip sleeve blouse. Piper is trying to get a milk bone, so I have to give her a milk bone. <laughs> Animals are just like kids. Okay, so let's go to the next. The next looks like a sweater. Mm. It's a sweater and it's coming across I think as red but actually it's kind of like a rust and it's got pockets right there white and rust that's what it's yeah 
kind of you can see through it okay this is called love ellie it's a two pocket cotton blend cardigan and it's burnt orange okay coming across as burnt rust to me but it's called burnt orange oh, oh these are different these are different these are from um driftwood now from first glance they look cute you know i got the distress through the leg a little pulling effect here's the bottom so the bottom is like a frayed hem at the bottom and then it's got this detail you guys if this isn't retro that is very 70s and then this is the pocket kind of a little distress around the seam huh okay let's see here it's an embroidered cuff straight leg jean and the color is indigo hmm. we'll see all right now remember this one Ooh, hint of blue it's a purse Now, you guys, I don't know if you remember any of my other stitch fixes. I'm very particular about my purses. And blue would not be a color that I'm interested in. It's very pretty, though. Oh, it's got this cute little key. Very, very pretty. And it's a handle. Very pretty. Um... It's a fossil, it's a little stiff. You know, if I was to keep it, could I get in there really good? It's got a zipper compartment and it's got a gray lining. So it's got a zipper compartment here. Oh, it's so stiff. So that's the zipper. And then it's got in the back, another little pocket and it says fossil. Now, do these come off? The straps do not come off, and it comes with that cute little key on there. Hmm. Oh, you know what? Then it's another little pocket. This is the front. Okay, so this is the back where it says fossil, and then this is the front where that little pocket is. Hmm. Okay. All right. And this is a fossil Chelsea leather crossbody, and it's blue. All right, so I'm gonna try this stuff on and let's see what it looks like. I'm really debating. No, I'm gonna try everything on. I promised you guys I would try everything on and all these stitch fixes and I'm gonna do it. So I'll be right back with you to show you everything that I tried on. You guys, first outfit, I've got the sweater on with the cute pockets. It's that burnt orange with the stripes. Here's what it looks like close up. Here's the back. Okay, and I've got it paired with the jeans. You guys, I am not a fan of these jeans. Whew, I've got big thighs and these pants. They accentuate my legs and they make my legs look shorter than what they are. I mean, look at that. Woof, girls. Mm -mm. These are not flattering at all. Mm -mm. Cause it's, it's too light right there. So it's making me look bigger. You know, I don't want to accentuate that. I do not want to look better, bigger. I want to look better, not bigger. The sweater hides everything, though. I mean, it's a cute concept, and it'd be cute on me if maybe it was longer. I don't know. Hmm. I'm trying to show you the top of the pants. You know. They're, I mean, they're trying to be cute. You know, like everything you try on is not going to be cute on you. That's just the thing. I don't know. I'm not a fan of the sweater, you guys, and I'm not a fan of the pants. Like, 
the pants themselves just hanging are cute and I no, they're just not cute for me okay you guys let me know what you think about these pants and this sweater but for me nope not a go all right next outfit okay you guys here is top number two so we first had on the sweater with the stripes in the jeans and now this is the ruffle top off the shoulder buttons down the front it's coming across as black but it's actually a navy with white dots here's the arms it gathers and it has a ruffle and then here's the back And I paired it up with my jeans. I do have a belt on. Oh, I took my belt off, you guys. I'm so sorry. So it blouses up. <laughs> sorry for that. It blouses up really cute. And I'm just going to show you what I'm wearing it with. I'm wearing it with a pair of my ripped jeans and my booties. It's a cute top. You can barely see the buttons really cute top yeah hmm. blouse is up really nice hmm I'm not sure you guys show you the arms again and I think the arms kind of want to kind of blouse up so they kind of feel like they just want to go underneath and kind of do this I suppose you could just like the blouse you know hmm okay you guys tell me what you think about this one and it's not staying off the shoulder it's supposed to be an off the shoulder blouse like I suppose it's supposed to be like this hmm I don't know what you could you see and when it's kind of like this it feels kind of like it's pulling so when it's like this it feels better oh there's that little thing that you put on a hanger that little strap hmm okay let's try on the next top okay you guys top number two this is the green with the print it's got the ruffle around the neck really cute detail gathering right here tulip sleeves on this I like a tulip sleeve, that's really nice. Tulip on this side. Turn it around so you can see it in the back. Ooh, it covers the bum. Really cute. And yes, I've got it paired up with my ripped jeans and my booty sh shoes. I like this neck. I like those pickaboos or these type of cuts right here it's it's like a dressy top but you can wear it you know like if you're just gonna go hang out and I do have my belt on so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tuck it in to see what it looks like like halfway tucked in so if you just kind of wanted to be more casual and not so dressy that's how it would look you know just tuck it in right there do it really simple kind of effortlessly to look like you didn't have to do much now let's try it with the purse here it is the fossil remember this is the front i thought this was the front because it said fossil but this is the front okay put it across untuck the shirt now just to get to see where it hits hits at a good spot and you can make it longer or shorter really nice I'm like where it's hitting now not bad mm-hmm you know if this purse was black or brown or tan I'd really love it I am NOT a fan of colored purses like this huh it's very cute though hmm let me show you the back Okay, hmm. 
back up so you can see the whole outfit. Bring the purse to the front so you can see. The shirt does hit nice, it covers. I like that. And I feel like you could dress this shirt up and leave it like this, or you can tuck it in and for more, I don't know if that's even more casual or more dressy, but you can do what you want. And you can put these jeans with heels, you know, and make it even more dressy, like a work. Put it with some dress slacks. That would be cute. Oh, some white slacks, you know, some cream slacks maybe for the summertime or some cream shorts. That'd be really cute. Okay, you guys, let's go downstairs and let's talk about these outfits. Okay, you guys, so I think you're feeling the same thing I'm feeling. I'm not really thrilled about anything. The green top was actually cute. It didn't wow me. The navy with the polka dots. It was cute, but it didn't wow me. The jeans are definite no-no, and that sweater is a no-no. And that purse, if you like blue, is okay. It's a no-no for me. At least I know those three things for sure. So here's the style guide. They try to tell you what you compare everything with. Okay, cool. All right, let's find out how much everything is, you guys. Come on, Pipes. Piper wants to come up. Come on. Come on, Piper. Come on, Pipes. All right. Here we go. Sanctuary. Off-the-shoulder ruffle navy top. $89. Wow. Okay. The two-pocket cotton blended burnt orange sweater, $38. Hmm. I'm very surprised that was $38. Um, the 41 Hawthorne, it's Tiffany tulip sleeve blouse, and that was green. That was $58. Mm -hmm. That was, you know, it was a blouse. It's good for like working or going out to dinner. It's really cute. Um, the Fossil crossbody bag or purse, that was $138. Um, and the Driftwood embroidered jeans, $118. My whole stitch fix, now it um, is, I already got a credit. Order totals, $330, styling fee. Um, they already charged me a $20 fee because now they're already a month ahead. So it was $310. Uh, I don't know if you can see that, $310. Um, you guys, I am not a fan. Only thing that I really, really, if I was to get anything out of this, is the green top with the tulip sleeves. Otherwise, I don't think I really liked anything. That's just the way it goes, you know? I don't know if I'm being too picky or not. None of that really matched my style. Maybe I have to do some changing up, putting some more comments in. Maybe I have to get a different stylist. I am not sure what I have to do, but... You guys, let me know what you think, and, you know, maybe I can try stuff out. Nah, it didn't change my mind. I don't know why I keep on thinking I'm going to buy it all when I'm not. Okay, you guys, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. Hit the cute little picture in the corner for the subscription. Hit the bell button for notifications. And I forgot to tell you guys, on this Saturday, I'm going to announce the winner um, of my Easter home tour. I had um two purse organizers and i'm gonna announce the winner of those on this saturday so stay tuned for my next video and we will see the winner until then you guys thanks for coming to my channel and watching i appreciate it piper appreciates it she had to sit in her mama's lap now Ch <laughs> now choppy's over there and he's wondering what's going on and if you see in my corner here like i have all this stuff going on I am getting rid of all my Easter stuff, you know, packing it away and trying to get my summer decor out. Um, so it's kind of all over the house right now. So sorry for that right there in the corner. But thanks again for coming to my channel, you guys. Until my next stitch fix, which will be June, because this was May's. Until then, talk to you guys later. Bye-bye. Deep end where a lot